Hello everyone, here in this video, I'm going to show you that how you can create a section of mark you text uh, with background image. So I have one request from one of my subscriber and they told me that they have needed a background image behind the uh, mark you sliding. So I have already added a lot of other features also. For example, we have background image, we have uh, text editing option, we have font size, font weight, text color, background color. You can also change the background color instead of background image. So we have two options. Then we have font family, animation speed. So you can increase and decrease the speed of this uh, mark you text. Uh, you can slow it down and maybe you can increase the speed. And you can also make it like right to left. Right now it is sliding from left to right and we can also slide it from right to left and left to right. So both directions you can choose. So let me show you that how you can do it yourself into your store. So firstly, let me delete this uh, option from here and let me save the changes. And then I am going to walk you through step by step. So firstly, you should go to the dashboard of the store and here you can see that I have installed down theme. If you have any other theme, then still this feature will work. So you should click on these three dots and duplicate this theme because if you are facing any issues or something, you can roll it back to its original version. So uh, once you're duplicating it, then after again, you need to click on these three dots and click on edit code. And here you can see that we have uh, multiple folders and files. So you need to click on sections, click on add a new section. And right now I'm going to create a section related to mark you. So you can write here mark you. Then you can click on done. And here we have an empty uh, section file. You need to clean this code first. So you should remove everything which is inside of it. I have already attached the code. So you just need to copy and paste the code. So I have this code. I will be adding the link below in the, in the description. So you should copy this complete section code and paste it into this file. Then after you should save the changes and go back to the dashboard and you should click on customize. And this section you can add in any of the page. I mean, uh, there is no restriction into that. You should click on add section and scroll it down and you will see that we have mark you text. So you should click on this section. Uh, let me refresh this page again. Uh, click on this add section, scroll down and here we have mark you text. So you need to click on this and you will see that we have a mark you text section added here. And I am interested to add the background image. So you should uh, see on the right hand side, we have background image option. So for say example, I am interested to add the image, which is this one and then click on done. So now you can see that we have a background image right here. Then after we have the section height. So if you want, you can increase and decrease the section height. Here you can see that we have the option to increase and decrease the section height. Then we have top padding and bottom padding. And then we have the mark you text. You can update this text with any of the thing which you are interested to put it here. Then we have the font size. So you can increase and decrease the font size here. Then we have same uh, font weight. So you can make it bolder or maybe you can uh, also make it much more thinner. For example, I'm putting it normal. So it will be looking like this, but right now I'm putting it semi bold. So it is looking more beautiful than that. Then you can also update the text color. So for say example, I am interested to put it uh, uh, maybe red color. So you can choose it like this. Right now I have added white, so I will keep it that. Then you have the text background color. If you want to add the background color instead of image, then you can also update it right here. Then we have font family. You have multiple options here. So for say example, I am changing the font family right here. You can see that this is different style of this text. So you can update it according to your requirement. Then we have the animation speed. So if you want to slow it down, you can select here. You can see that this is much more slower. And if I'm interested to make it much faster, it is also right here. So light, uh, right now I'm going to put it in the normal speed. Then we have the direction. You can choose here the direction from right to left and left to right. So this is also something which you can actually add it into your store. So if you want to add one more section, you can also go ahead and put it like this. And let me add one more background for say example i am putting like this and here we go now you can see that we have something different now 
and then you can also reduce the height of this yeah like this so this is looking more beautiful than before so once you are done then you can actually save the changes so that's how you can actually add multiple mark queue sliding in your shopify store so if you have any new feature to develop you can also uh, add me the questions below in the comment section i will definitely upload the video related to that i have already uploaded videos related to collection slider we have images slider we have testimonial slider we have product slider video slider and then a lot of other features i have already added so if you need any of them you can actually click on the link below in the description and definitely you will find the code so thank you so much for watching this video if you are new on this channel then please subscribe this channel also like this video thank you so much once again see you in the next video